guys, what's up? It's your boy Brian here. We're back at it with another video. Today, I got a nice special video for you guys. Working on my girl Stacy over here again. Uh, today, we're installing a Vortex generator. In my opinion, I think the Vortex generators give these Subarus such an aggressive look. I mean, all Subarus. So I'm actually really excited to get this uh, installed already. And this is the Vortex generator, at least the underside of it. Um, I was really excited. I didn't really want to wait for you guys. I didn't uh, wait to open the box during the video, but here it is. They provide the actual Vortex, which is um, very good. I ended up ordering off of Subaru Parts Pro, which I think is basically a reseller of like Subaru factory parts. Um, what you see here is basically what you'd get if you were to actually order it from the Subaru dealership itself. But I was lazy to drive there, so I just ordered it instead. Include uh, alcohol wipes, which you're definitely going to want to use or your Vortex can be peeling off within the first couple of days and the actual Vortex itself and also got some Robin alcohol and some microfiber cloths as well with me to make it even more clean because I'm not trying to risk anything I actually want it to come out good and if you don't really know what a Vortex generator is um, it's basically to give your car more aerodynamics um, I mean that's not the reason why I'm getting it I'm getting it just to give it the aggressive look and I know there's like a whole bunch of different like different Vortex generators out there um, I personally think these were my favorite the OEM ones that like come up halfway with the antenna. Um, I know there are some vortexes that go around the whole entire antenna. I mean, it's like a pretty, it's, it's a pretty thick boy, but I, I didn't like that one that much. I went with the nice, good old OEM one. And the install, it's not even really an install, but the way it goes on is with like this um, 3M tape, I want to say it is, no, it's double-sided. So when you have it all placed on, you can go ahead and peel it off and then it'll stick right on. And before I do continue on with this video, uh, I'd just like to appreciate uh, how thick I'm looking. That's at least like three C's right there. So after that, let's go ahead and hop back into this video. And now what I'm actually doing is cleaning it. Uh, first, I cleaned it with the microfiber cloth uh, with the rubbing alcohol. And then after that, which you'll see in a little bit, is me cleaning it with the prep pad that they actually gave in the box. And here is the prep pad that I was actually talking about. So yeah, you're going to want to go ahead and open that up and then go ahead and clean them. And before you do install it, please, 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 just double check, triple check, quadruple check. Make sure this thing's nice and clean and dry for it, you can get the, the best results and for it can last as long as like it can. So yeah, please. And as you can see, I have it just lined up and everything right now. So get it all lined up, then you can go ahead and peel back the tape. But yeah, I'm really excited to see how it's going to turn out. Some of y'all are probably wondering right now on, hey Brian, what does that even say? Well, maybe if you weren't fake and you follow me on my Instagram, you wouldn't be wondering that. Yeah, I think it actually came out really nice. It gives us such an aggressive look. So if you did enjoy this video, guys, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe. There's gonna be some more content coming out soon. Leave, uh, hit the notification bell so you can do know when the content does come out. And I will throw a link in the description of the, if you didn't want to get a Vortex for yourself. And I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya.